channel. Thank you for watching. Today's video is going to be a birch box unboxing and this is what this month's box looks like and it is a birch box collaboration with Rifle Paper Company. I've never heard of them before but we got to pick the colour and theme of the box. I don't know if that makes a difference to what comes inside it or what but I picked the one with the yellow bottom and I think they're all I think they've all got flowers but this one's got pears on it so yeah. The leaflet inside this month says Bloomin' Marvellous and I think it's basically just spring themed. Inside as well we've got a exclusive for Birchbox UK subscribers 25% off your next order at riflepaperco.com use the code below so offer includes shipping The bag this month is orange again. I don't know if this is becoming a theme. I think the past two or three have been orange, but yeah. So the first thing I'm gonna grab, I'm just gonna get started and jump right in. Um, if you don't know what Birch Box is, I'll leave everything in the description box below, including the link to where you can subscribe yourself. The first thing I've picked up is the Cynthia Rowley Beauty eyeliner in black and this has an RRP of £11. This is a Birchbox exclusive and I'm pretty sure we've had one of these before. I remember, I don't know if it's a different product but I remember the packaging being like this with the bubbles on the lid. But yeah that's just a black eyeliner. Next we have Balance Me Tinted Wonder Eye Cream and the RRP for this is £20. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure these are all sample size this month. I'm not seeing any that say full size or anything like that. So It's just an eye cream with um, a tint in it and it's for all skin types, 99% natural and it's got light reflecting particles. And it's just a really light, it's got a little bit of a citrusy scent to it, but it's just a really light eye cream, so I'll give that a go. My eyes have been really irritated lately, so it'd be good if it's 99% natural. The next thing we have is a foot care cream, and I'm not even going to attempt to say the name because I'll butcher it, so I'll just let you see instead. It's got tea tree oil, royal jelly and sweet almond oil in it, so it should smell quite nice. Yeah, it smells really, really fresh, which is good for a foot cream. Next, we've got Parlour by Jeff Chastian. This is a detangling leave-in conditioner and the RRP is £17, Birchbox exclusive. It it's just a detangling spray. Um, so this is just so this is just a detangling spray for um, your hair, and it's a leave-in conditioner as well. Okay, this one smells nice. This one smells like shampoo or conditioner or something. Just your kind of general shampoo smell so that's quite nice I think I'll probably use that and last but not least we have Ju the Hula and this is I've seen it all over you've probably seen it all over YouTube and social media this is one of Benefit's uh, new releases and that's it there it's obviously just a little sample size in the box the packaging it's so cute. And this is basically, if anybody is a fan of the Benefit Hula Bronzer, um, this is like a, supposed to be a liquid version of it, so. Put it on this hand because this hand doesn't have anything on it. That's what it looks like. And it just gives a really, smells really nice. It smells like beachy products. 
it just gives a really subtle kind of bronzy tinge to the skin. I think this would be good if you don't like to self tan your face which is something I've stopped doing but if you don't like to self tan your face then you can slap this on. I don't know how it would work as I don't think you could use it for contouring or anything like that like hula but I think it would be really good if you don't want to fake tan your face and you just want to slap something on without having you know like brown neck white face so that would be really good. That benefit uh, do the hula. Um, the RRP for it is $22.50 and basically says smooth onto bare skin or over foundation for all over radiance. So I suppose if your foundation was too light you could put it on to kind of deepen it down a little bit and give you more of that kind of sun kissed look. It isn't really strong or anything like that so you can probably get away with just getting a kind of summer glow. That's everything that's in this month's birch box. As I said, everything will be listed in the description box, including how to subscribe to Birchbox if you're not already, or just a link to their website if you want to go on and look and see what it's all about. But I do highly recommend Birchbox, and the reason that I get Birchbox, a lot of people people ask me why do I get Birchbox and why don't I get Glossy Box? I get it kind of through my mum anyway. Um, but you know why? Why did I pick Birchbox? And the reason I picked Birchbox was benefit products. I've gotten one, two, three, to hand. I've gotten the push-up liner, the Their Real mascara, the Their Real tinted mascara, tinted. Their Real Tinted Lash Primer, now the Do The Hula. I've gotten <clears throat> quite a few Benefit products in Birchbox and I really like Benefit so I think that for that anyway that I think the Birchbox is worth it. And some of the things you get like the eye creams and things like that I think are really really reasonable to be getting in something that costs £12 a month so yeah. Um, pretty good this month. I We'll definitely give the products a go and hopefully some of them will work out but I'll keep you posted and I think that's it. I felt like this video was really quick but anyway that's quite good I suppose. But yeah so if you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and hopefully I'll see you in the next one. Bye.